This is tutorial number 21, and it covers drafting on the parting line. Now we're going to use the object that we made in the first draft function. All that we're going to do though is we're going to delete the two drafts. So let's click draft 1, press control, click draft 2, right click and press delete, click yes to all, and now we have our cube that we first began with. Now let's click draft and let's change the type of draft to a parting line. To do the parting line draft, first we need to choose a direction of pull. So let's choose it along this line. And now we have to pick a parting line. And let's pick this line right here. And now let's press OK. And now we've cut along in that direction on the 60 degree angle. Now let's right click this draft, click edit feature, and we're able to change the angle to 15 degrees. Click OK, and now you can see that we cut down just 15 degrees. Now as we cut in, we can also create out. So let's right click this function again, click edit feature. Let's put this back to the 60 degrees, and now Let's change the direction of pull, and now it's going to create the object up instead of taking it out. So let's click OK, and now we've created it up 60 degrees. Now let's right click on this again, click Edit Feature, and let's make it 15 degrees. Click OK, and now you can see that we only made it 15 degrees up. And this concludes our tutorial of the drafting function on the parting line.